our ciabatta dough, and uh, every day we do ciabatta. Most of the ciabatta uh, loaves go for uh, our sandwiches that we do, uh, and then there's a lot of regulars that will pick up a ciabatta loaf, sometimes get them sliced and bake some sandwiches at home, or just eat them before they even get them. So, anyways, this is what it looks like coming out of our uh, first fermentation. At this point, we just basically divide it and bake it. So lots of flour, it's a very wet dough, so it's sticky. how you load them up? Yeah, we put, so we put it on our loader and we just kind of make sure that uh, they're in decent shape before uh, going into the oven. And once we stick them in the oven, we steam it and uh, that what gives it the volume. It helps it rise and become our golden brown ciabatta. How long does it take them to bake? Uh, yeah, 20 to 22 minutes. Okay. Yeah, it's soft. Natalie is working on our croissants over there. Now that we have everything on our loader, we're going to go ahead and steam the oven uh, just to provide a little bit of humidity, kind of welcome our little dough in there. And then uh, rise it up to the level. They all get dropped off simultaneously and then we hit two seconds of steam again that helps it to raise the uh, get that dollar. Our little ciabatta rolls. They make awesome hamburger buns. Cedar 65 is now serving all of their hamburgers on our ciabatta rolls. And for those interested in dietary concerns, our ciabatta has three ingredients flour, water, salt, oh, I forgot olive oil. Premium olive oil. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
baked ciabatta loaves. Great for sandwiches at home as well as at the Evergreen Bread Bank.